Hey, welcome back guys. This is the Marshmallow from Team Gaming here and this is Craig. This is my computer that I've had for the past almost two years. I've been using it to play Java Jazz and make videos and all that stuff. And ever since I built my new computer, it's just been sitting in my room on my big break with my closet. So there is a lot of dust in this thing, so today we're going to be giving it a good cleaning. Well, probably not. Like, we're probably not going to take a bunch of stuff apart, but we're going to take out all the components and components and take all the dust out of them, like the case fans and the CPU cooler that's definitely got a lot of dust in there and it's disgusting. And after that, we're going to put it back all together. This is the gear I'm going to be using to clean my PC. I've got some paper towel, some isopropic alcohol, the 97%, I think. Um, we've got some zip ties for cable management, um, thermal paste that came with my CPU cooler. Um, I hope there's enough in there. Um, we've got some Q-tips, some scissors, and my screwdriver. So, without further ado, let's get started. It's better with time Control me, I'll always be lonely. 
I'll never be fine If life is a movie It's always so boring Where is the story? I hope it gets better with time Yeah, I hope it gets better with time
Okay, so we're finally done. Um, I think I've done everything right. I'm not really sure though. So the only way to know is to finally power this thing on and see if it works. Oh, the motherboard light is on, so that's good news. Are you ready? Wow! Let's turn the monitor on. But what do you know? It works! And, um, let's just make sure. Alright. Oh, looks like there's Windows already installed on it. But I remember factory resetting it, so nothing should happen. But let's just test that all the fans are working. Yep. 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 And, and both the frontal fans are working too. Before, when Craig made it, one of the other fans actually was broken remember it was snapped off so only one of the fans were working but now I put the fan that was here in front I don't know where that why there was one there and put it there and now both the fans are working so that is very nice <clears throat> again there's only a hard drive in there's a storage drive so of course Windows Windows is gonna be pretty slow but all you need is to get an SSD in there and it'll boot up a lot faster and yeah, this PC is good to go. It's all cleaned up. It looks... I mean, the cable management is... And it's better than it was before I tried, but... Honestly, I, I'm really proud. We... I didn't think I could do this, but I, I did. Um, I think I'm going to have to thank Craig for building me this PC in the first place because he's the one that got me into computers. Well, him and my friend Evan and both my uncle Patrick and my cousin Jason. So thanks all of you for getting me into computers and making me want to do this. Yeah, so sorry if the camera angles weren't as good as they could have been, but I hope you guys learned something about cleaning and building a computer and maintaining it so um if i learned anything during this episode and if you guys learned anything is please don't use this case i mean i don't want to like it definitely has pros like it's got a giant fan at the top so that's good for cooling like cool like airflow in this case is it's it's decent enough but cable management nah if you're a beginner then you're not gonna want to use this case Craig is pretty good at building computers so this is probably these parts were probably all he had lying around so yeah but yeah I hope you guys I really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please make sure to leave a like and maybe subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, well, yeah, that's. And the mouse works? Yeah. Well, that's it for this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!